Alrighty, so we finally have a look at the Season 11 update. It has been nine whole months, which I think might be the longest I've ever seen a game go without a season. They had updates, but they were kind of meh. I think they might have had like a few skins, and to be quite honest, maybe a few Twitch drops and that's it. So this, and I've already seen this trailer. Uh, somebody sent it, a friend sent it to me yesterday, and it was literally 40 minutes before I went to work. So I haven't been able to play or anything, but I did want to do a kind of a reaction video. I've seen it, but I want to go through it and just see in case I missed anything. I want to just talk about it, how I feel, some of my other friends that I've talked to and how they feel who are also content creators, and just see if this is a game that we think is still going to be good and we're going to continue to play. Rated E10 for ages 10 and up. Hey, super animals. Bob and I just got back from the island where the beavers gave us an early look at the upcoming Super Animal World expansion for Super Animal Royale. We're so excited that you're so excited about it. So we managed to smuggle so out funny a that I know. for you. Actually, I want to look back. There's We're some so people I actually know in these comments. Obviously, I know Coyote. I recognize this person. Uh, excited about it. I know this person. This person comments on my videos a lot. Uh, kind of getting muddled. So we managed to smuggle out a tiny taste for you. But first, we have a few big surprises to share. By popular request, Actually. today we're dropping one more Animal Pass before Super Animal World debuts, and it's called the By Popular Request Pass. This looks better than the Filled last with one. cosmetic items inspired <clears throat> by community requests from over the years, the By Popular Request Pass is our way of saying thank you to the amazing community of more it's than 12 million players. It's a pretty lit pass, especially that Plague Doctor game. outfit. And That's we're now back pretty to good. Publishing and thus free so, to make. this is what I wasn't 100% sure. We're full indie and a hard working beginning chapter of this. So this is what I was, I don't know if what's going on, but the last nine months, I'm going to assume between Super Animal World and whatever happened, I don't know if they're talking about Modus is a company that they also work with because they're the studio and I don't know what their work is because Modus has other games I've seen. So I'm going to assume the main reason it took them so long is because whatever legal stuff they had to, to be, I don't want to say self-employed, but to be kind of left alone, do what they want, have full control of their game again, is kind of what it was the problem. Which makes me, I don't want to, like, I don't, like, forgive is the wrong word, but have a lot more grace towards them and, you know, totally understand, because if that's the case, nine months is not that long for legal crap. Uh, I can definitely say that. Um, and to be honest, the rest of this video is full of things that I am so happy to see and that I'm extremely optimistic about. I really hope that in the coming, like, few months, they continue because what they did now is like a whole new season and it's really cool. Dumb business decisions. We're making it a proper thank you by making it free this for all players is to awesome. play between now and the release of Super Animal World. Highlights include the Plague Doctor, Idol, and Trash Can outfits, the Mini Bearded Dragon, the Shy Emote, That's cool. and the Broken Health Juice Blender Gravestone, commemorating the Health Juice Blender, huh. which has been removed from the game by popular request. Weird. The That's interesting. Because they didn't mention adding anything, so they just took that out. I didn't see any guns, I didn't see any, you know, utilities or anything like that. But I will say, adding the free battle pass seems like they actually care, and they're trying to say sorry for the lack of content and stuff just for people in general. So I'm very happy to see that. That's a very good step in a very good direction, in my opinion. And other people I've talked to, like, that's one of the highlights. Out of probably, if I had top three, that's probably maybe even one because that shows yeah it pretty much just shows that people who can't afford it or people who just don't want to spend the money you know can't spend the money whatever it is can have or they're just kids have a free battle pass and then uh he's gonna say this i'm kind of spoiling the the saw tickets you can get from that you can literally buy a whole nother battle pass which is awesome to me so that's a definitely a w on pixel studios part new season also includes six new popularly requested super animal breeds and we've added some nice quality of life improvements for the zip and go and other items that you can read about in the patch notes. The buy popular request pass is available now. The pass is completely free, but for those looking for ways to support the development of our next big thing, look no further. The Super Animal World supporter pack. Okay, I want to take a look at this. So, bugs, flag, emote, 
Bearded the Dragon, the Mini Dragons gangster. You can't see it, my face cam's in the way. But if I was gonna be honest, I think that out of these three breeds, the Star Deer is my favorite. I really like that. Super cool idea, and I think it just, it works really well. DLC features three new super animal breeds. The Super Dawn Songbird, Super Midnight That's Deer, awesome. and Super Dusk That's Raccoon. pretty cool too, actually. The pack also includes 12 new cosmetic items themed for the Super Animal World expansion. Highlights include the Race Start Emote, that's and cool. Dragon Pet. 750 saw tickets are also included, enough to pick up an archived animal pass. The Super w. Animal World Supporter Pack DLC is available now. We think it's a great value, as well as the best way to show your support as we prepare for the next chapter. I mean, chapter I think that thing is 10 bucks, which is totally Finally, legit. It wouldn't be summer in Super Animal World without the Super Summer Royale event. This year's Super End of Summer yeah. Royale includes five new Super Animal breeds and nine new cosmetics to be earned over the three-week event, with new unlocks each week. The End of Summer Celebration starts today, featuring the Super Tomato Frog in Week 1, so get out there and start collecting fruit. We're happy yeah, so... That also makes me think that all the legal stuff that happened, re just like they, they wanted Super Animal World to come out because I think that was on their, I don't want to say plan, but it was on their like for 2024 spreadsheet thing that they had where, you know, what we wanted to do, roadmap, that's the word. Um, and they just, they wanted to get that done because it's it's literally almost October and they're doing end of summer. Uh, summer ended like literally over a month ago. Well, actually it, it's not quite October, I'll give them that. It's been, you know, a month. So I definitely think that they are trying to get as much stuff as they can now to keep us happy until Christmas or at least until Halloween and then Christmas. Happy to update the game today, but we know you're probably also ready for an update on the big expansion. So without further ado, Here's a tiny look at Super Animal World. Very tiny. Super Animal World adds a few relaxing activities to enjoy between savage fights to the death. Fishing the island's biohazardous waters will yield an abundance. So wait, he said in between. I'm confused as to whether this is a like Fortnite creative where it'll be a totally different game mode. The storm or the gas is non-existent. You can go catch bugs, fish, race you can't hurt each other or if this is all stuff you can do in the battle royale or both like you could go and play that and be left alone or you can also fish in the battle royale because he said in between so i don't know what that implies let's go back super animal world adds a few relaxing activities to enjoy between savage fights to the death fishing the island's biohazardous waters will yield an abundance of aquatic life both familiar and uncanny that's bug cool. Collecting is a casual way to explore the island's array of I hope they add bugs. They have to add bugs now. As skins. Enhanced ball racing adds another fun competitive That's awesome. Mode, minus the near certainty. Of I don't that. care what anybody says. Enhanced ball racing awesome. adds another fun competitive mode. Minus the near certainty. Of I death. love that so much. That's all we can show right now, but we're packing a lot more into the expansion, and that's why it's taking us a little longer than expected. We're now anticipating Super Animal World will arrive this winter. With that, we need to get back to work and you need to go check out the completely free new Animal Pass, the Supporter Pack DLC, and the Super Summer Royale event, W's. which are all available right now. See you on the island, Super Animals. If I'm gonna be honest, the only downside to this entire thing that I'm seeing, the only downside, in my opinion, is I don't understand how Super Animal World is gonna come along, how that's gonna work, and I hope that they didn't just dump all this stuff on us, and this is gonna be all we're gonna have for the next two months until Christmas. If that's the case, then that kinda sucks. You know, I understand they just did give us a lot, but I do hope they add a little bit, even if it is only skins, kind of some Halloween skins, and then maybe uh, some Thanksgiving skins and that kind of stuff. Because then, honestly, 10 out of 10, I think they did a great job. Especially if they had legal issues, I can't blame them at all. They did really great with this season. W's Pixel.